If you ask somebody why they don't fly, they will typically give you one of two excuses. It's too expensive or I have no place to go. Clearly, neither of those is true for a very large number of people, much larger than the number of people who do fly. Because they travel all the time and they spend a lot of money on things that are more expensive than aviation. It's simply a choice we make. Again, thinking back into economic terms, we talk about need. And we need to remember the only thing you really need is food and shelter. After that, everything is just want. But we'll call it need anyway. Does anybody need an airplane? I don't know. Does anybody need a BMW? No. You know, a lot of benefit to it. Of course, they, people, they wouldn't sell so many of them. What we don't do a good job is selling that benefit. If we do, I absolutely believe there's the disposable income, there is the need, the benefit, the value there, and we've got to make it easier and more and educate them better. So the answer is not, I don't have any place to go and I can't afford it. The answer is, and it's tougher to get them to admit it because these aren't the kinds of things that people like to say, especially people who are talking to Superman while they say it. It's too hard and I'm scared. Those are the two real reasons why more people don't fly. It's too hard and I'm scared. Followed by, it's really uncomfortable. I went for a ride when I was a kid and it was really embarrassing when I threw up in the back seat because the airplane was bouncing all over, you know, part of what you guys were talking about last night. Um, we can fix those things. If I had my choice, everybody's first ride in an airplane would be either an open cockpit biplane or an SR-22. There's a bunch of other airplanes that add, are pretty good value points for their price but they're not the way you show somebody how to fly. And as an industry, we've all heard about the introductory flight, and the introductory flight ends up being a let me show you how you land the airplane. Are we nuts? You know, <laughs> The introductory flight should be let me show you how you're going to use the airplane. This is how great flying can be. Oh, by the way, you gotta get your license, and we'll show you how to do that someday. But first, let's get them hooked. I mean, drug dealers have known this forever, right? <laughs> get them hooked. Then show them what happens. Aero TV is brought to you by Integra Release 9 sets a new standard with the easiest to use pilot interface in all of general aviation. Access to any of Release 9's powerful capabilities is as simple as pressing the desired bi-directional page key. Pressing the same key in a desired direction navigates to the clearly labeled tabs with no more guessing as to what a given pilot input would do. Avidyne's Integra Release 9 is the next generation in fully integrated flight deck technology and the easiest to use page and tab user interface is just one of the many benefits designed to make your flying easier and safer.